what's going on YouTube welcome back to the channel guess what we're gonna go get right now at the post office we're gonna go pick up a brand new rod from Dobbins it's a new 795 SB and we're also gonna pick up a mediocre swim bait order from tackle warehouse a lot of expensive baits or expensive to me baits um, and not a lot of them but enough um, so yeah, I just figured I'd take you guys with me, give you guys a little bit more of the background. So Took a little bit to get the packages and everything in the store. I had to wait for UPS basically. So it's the next day. I unboxed this last night, but I just want to show you guys what I got. It's all swim baits. All here. This is what I got here. So I'll go through this with you real quick. Each individual one. Um, I'm gonna kind of combine this. So okay, so these are two you've seen me unbox in the past. This is the Biwa 7, it's in the 5 inch, uh, this bluegill pattern, really detailed. Uh, so this is my swim bait arsenal in general. Then the S Waver 168 light trout uh, glide bait. So those are two I already had. So to add to that, this order I got last night, this is the Lucky Craft Real AU, I think it's called an AU, I don't know. But it's a 7 inch glide bait it weighs in at almost two ounces it's got these feather trebles uh, and this is in I'm just gonna call it a sexy shag color because it's got the blue on the top of the chartreuse line but this thing is I bought this mostly because of the price this was nine bucks this is the Molex pike shad and it's got a treble hook on the bottom for a stinger you can put it up in the belly if you want you can leave it hanging it's got a little Colorado blade for vibration it's a jointed soft plastic swim bait meaning it's got these little hinges in here like a glide bait would so this tail whole tail kicks not just a paddle and then it's got the jig hook this weighs in at just over two ounces uh, this is five and a half inches long super lifelike um, it looks really good and for nine bucks I'll give it a shot and then the last two baits that I got were Hoddleston six inch and this is in the phantom juvenile trout uh, our lakes around here are all stocked with trout, so I'm hoping to connect on some good sized fish with this. I got this in the ROF 5 and the ROF 12, which basically all that is is the weight and it's the rate of fall. So the 12 falls 12 feet for every 10 seconds, the 5 falls 5 feet for every 10 seconds. And uh, so, yeah, there's that. These aren't the 68 special, they're just a regular 6 inch. And then I got some 174 pounds single wire. Uh, if you haven't seen Tackle Warehouse, uh, Tactical Passings, how to rig video, I'll link that down in the description. It's really informative, especially about these Huddleston 6s, 8s, 10s, even like the Battles Trail from Working Class Zero. It all goes together. It makes it really simple to add stinger hooks and stuff like that. Now, the last thing I got was a dedicated swim bait rod and this thing is mondo i mean this thing's giant and this is the dobbins 795 fury series it's uh when i pulled it out of the package last night it was way nicer than i thought it was going to be uh it's got the nice foam handle all the way back it's got a front grip i got my loose mg on here uh just because 
the reel I bought, the Daiwa in the previous Tackle Warehouse unboxing, was a little bit faster than I wanted, so I put that on my top water rod, which you guys will see in the next video, which is my rod and reel arsenal, so stay tuned for that. Uh, but this rod seems super nice, seven foot nine. It's a medium heavy, which is strange. Uh, it's a little bit smaller diameter than my St. Croix, but it's rated one to five ounces. And I mean, this thing's just, it's just insane. Uh, I'm super excited to throw this and get some big fish on it. So that was my type of warehouse unboxing. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, smash that like button. Uh, I thought it might be a little more interesting, a little faster if I took them out of the packages at first and then just went through them with you. So, as always, like this video, comment down below if there's any bait in here in particular that you want to see a video on, a tutorial, something like that. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. It's free, it doesn't cost anything, it's super easy to do. It lets the channel grow, helps me you know, know I'm making good content and you guys are enjoying it. So, with that said, I'll catch you guys on the next video.